welcome back to my channel my name is Melissa for those of you who are new and I create new videos every week and this week I'm going to be sharing with you guys my updated skincare routine high-end and low-end products so this video is not sponsored but a company did reach out to me to send a PR package out for me to be able to review in a skincare routine video the so Duval was kind enough to send me their radiant spin care system which is this package that you see right here and it's a really awesome skincare system so what it is is basically you have your handheld head brush here that is battery operated and you have four adaptable head brushes one being the Puma stone which you can put on and you can use for any sort of pedicures you have a body exfoliator brush which is really nice because it's a very large head and you have a cleanser brush and then you have a face exfoliator brush as well so I've been incorporating this system into my skincare routine and I honestly really love it so it's really awesome about the skincare spin system is that it actually rotates the head brush 360 degrees so you really get a really good clean that way and it's not like some of these brushes where it just kind of vibrates the head this actually spins and gives you 360 degrees of great exfoliation for either your body your face and if you guys want one of your own they were kind enough to go ahead and send me a discount code for you guys to try so I'll go ahead and pop that up on the screen here for you guys to be able to try this radiant spin care system for 70% off and I'll also have their link in the description box below if you guys do choose to try it out with me and incorporate it as part of your skincare routine system like I have. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. The first product that I like to use when first removing my full face makeup is the Bioderma Sensible H2O Makeup Removing Micelle Solution. So basically what I do is that I just take some cotton pads like this and I just get a little bit of the makeup remover onto the cotton pads and just start to remove the makeup from my under eyes and all my eye makeup. For my cleanser, I've gone ahead and made the switch over to the Banny Cream Gentle Facial Cleanser for sensitive skin. And this cleanser is really great because it is not tough on your skin at all, but it still removes any impurities that may have been left over as residue. And what I like to do is I just like to put a couple of pumps on it onto my Zubal Skin Care Radiance Brush. Run it under a little bit of lukewarm water and get to cleansing. that my face is nice and clean and stripped of all makeup and dirt and grime and oils now is whenever your skin is hungry for some nutrients so this next product is something that I like to use to nourish my skin after I have cleaned it and cleansed it so this is the skin pharmaceutical C and E Ferulic serum this is one of the higher end products believe it or not this little bottle here runs you about $166 I was really debating whether or not to purchase Purchase this because I've never purchased anything quite this expensive for skincare but I have to tell you guys that I've had this now for almost a month and a half I would say and I've used about this much of the bottle so a little bit goes a long way with the higher end products and this will realistically probably last me about three or four months so if you take 166 divided by three or four it's really not that much it's just about what you would pay for at a higher end drugstore product about forty dollars or so what i like to do is i like to take the dropper and put a couple of drops on the high points of my face so the forehead the cheekbones is kind of where a lot of your skin gets damaged because those are where the sun kind of hits your face first so I like to just rub it in and I always like to take any excess and rub it up towards my neck now I'm going to follow it up with some lotion based face cream from Murata & Co. You guys have seen this in my previous skincare routine videos. I still like these. These are one of my favorites actually. This is the Chia Seed Oil Face Serum. So I like to take just a couple of drops of this and place it onto my skin. Now 
And next up, I'm gonna be using the Ole Hendrickson Banana Bright Eye Cream for your under eyes. I just like to take a couple of dabs of this and I'll just place it on my ring finger and I like to dab it underneath my eyes and then also the top of my lids. And with this, you don't want to rub, you want to pat in to prevent any wrinkles under your under eyes. So since we are getting ready for bed, I like to put on a face night cream, which is a little bit thicker. But for that, I like to use also the Rada & Co. Chia Seed Oil Night Cream. And then for this, just take a couple of dabs and then also don't forget the neck. And we can't forget about the lips. So for this, I like to use the Wellita Skin Food Hydrating Lotion. This is really great for you if you have really dry skin. Um, only thing about this though is if you have sensitive skin, I try to put this on my face, but it tends to warm up as it starts to react with your body. So the first time I put this on my face, I just got completely red because it was warming up. So if you have sensitive skin, I wouldn't recommend this putting it on your face, but as far as your body and your lips, it's really great for hydration. And last but not least, we all want to have nice, long, beautiful, lush lashes. And this next little tip and trick has actually helped me grow my lashes. So what it is, is basically just castor oil that I've put in a little wand here that I like to brush onto my lashes each night before I go to bed. So that does it for the night portion of my skincare routine. I will see you guys in the morning. Good night. Good morning guys. Since I already cleaned and cleansed my face the night before, I just like to wash my face with lukewarm water just because your skin produces its natural oils overnight and you don't want to strip all of that away. Now that I've rinsed my face off, I just want to apply a little bit more of the Skin Ferulic Serum just to hydrate my face again. So just a couple drops, not too much because we already applied this the night before. And just rub it into the skin. And I'm just gonna go back in with the Ole Hendrickson Banana Bright Under Eye Cream. Last step in my skincare routine before I go ahead and start my makeup routine is SPF. So it is so important to protect your skin from the sun. What I like to use is the SkinCeuticals Physical Fusion UV Defense. It's an SPF 50. What I really like about this sunscreen is that it doesn't leave your skin feeling oily, which a lot of these sunscreens will do. And this is a nice tinted sunscreen. So what I like to do is I just like to shake it up a little bit and just apply some rub it on my hands and then apply to my face especially on the high points of the face because that is where the sun will hit first all right guys so that does it for my skincare routine this is a mix of low and high end products. Like I said, I'll leave all the links to all these products down below in the description box, as well as the link for the Duval company that was kind enough to send me this PR package. Thank you guys so much. And also that discount code if you guys would like to purchase the Radiant Spin Care System for yourselves. Remember it is 70% off. And now I'm gonna go ahead and get ready for the rest of my day, but I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're not subscribed already, make sure that you hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell on the side so you don't miss when new videos go live and if you enjoyed this video give it a big thumbs up on the bottom and leave me a comment down below as to what product piqued your interest and i will see you guys in the next one bye guys